What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create floating text in Vegas Pro 15. So for this you're going to need something known as Sapphire Plugins, if you don't already have Sapphire Plugins then I highly recommend you do get it. A link to it will be in the description. So currently on the screen, this is what I have. It's just a time lapse of a dirt road, so of course the clouds are only going to be the thing moving. First thing we need to do is add some text. So for that, head over to Media Generators, come up to Legacy Text, and add on one with the checkered background. So I'm gonna add on this, drag and drop it on. Now here, I will just put Savage, and I will change the outline to a black stroke, so it's gonna be more visible like this. And I'm gonna come up to the properties and bring in the track in a little bit. So I'm happy with my text, I'm then just going to shorten this down, I'm going to add fade in and I'm also going to add a fade out. So from here we're then going to head over to video effects and from video effects you want to look for S underscore shake. Now I'm going to add on the default by dragging and dropping onto the text. Now for those that watch my Leafy is here video of over a year ago when I showed you how to do his uh, cartoon shaking, it's very similar to that. So the amplitude we're literally going to bring close to zero. And this does all depend on personal preference. So however you want the text to be looking and how smooth you want it. So this is now at with the amplitude at 0 0.068 and the frequency at 1.32. They're the only two things you need to change when doing this effect. So I'm going to play it through. As you can see, we get a slight bit of floating text. So if you want it to be more violent, you can say, bring up the frequency and also bring up the amplitude. I'll turn this to good and auto, so hopefully there's no lag. I'm playing it through again. You can see this is now how it looks. What I do recommend you do, turn off the fades if you have them on, double click, and then press this button, which is loop playback. Now what this is gonna do, you can play this through, and at the same time, you can adjust the frequency and the amplitude so you can see real time how this effect will look when you change it. So as you can see this is a really nice one, I think this is a good one. So the amplitude is at 0.102, the frequency is at 1.52. And you can just keep playing around like this, I like this though, if you like it as well then you can copy them settings. I also recommend creating a preset if you tend to use it quite a lot. I'm just going to call this one text float, I'm then going to press save. I'm going to X out of it, I can pause the video, and then when I come back to S underscore shake in the future, it's going to be right here. Now you can also do the same thing for the video itself, so I'm going to drag and drop this onto the video track. I'm going to X out of it, and now what we're going to have is the video and the, the uh, text shaking, so you can see, that's what we have. And remember the uh, video has the exact same shake as the text, that's why you can't really see the text moving as much. So if we just bring this up and you'll now see the difference. You can see there's the background going more violent where the text is just a bit more smoother. But that's the end of this video, that's how simple it is to create floating text in Vegas Pro 15.